Hi everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel Dr. Srinivas Medical Concepts and my every page Dr. Srinivas Concepts. This is Dr. Srinivas, neurologist from Rajmandri, Andhra Pradesh, India. I am also the medical author of the book Focused Neurology. My email is sriklpm at gmail.com. Today we are going to talk about a very interesting topic, the, cranial, the glossopharyngeal nerve, that is the ninth cranial nerve, part 1 and cranial nerves part 61. So the clinical anatomy of the glossopharyngeal nerve, that is the ninth nerve. Clinical anatomy. The glossopharyngeal nerve, as its name implies, is distributed principally to the tongue and the pharynx. It conveys general sensory as well as special sensory taste fibers from the posterior third of the tongue. It also provides general sensory innervation to the pharynx. It conveys GVAs, general visual afferents, from the carotid body and the carotid sinus. Its skeletomotor neurons innervate the stylopharyngeus muscle and its parasympathetic component innervates the parotid gland. So you can see the in this diagram the clinical anatomy of the glossopharyngeal nerve. The glossopharyngeal nerve exits the skull through the jugular foramen. The brachiomotor fibers of the ninth nerve go to the pharynx. If ninth nerve supplies any muscle alone, it is the stylopharyngeus muscle which raises and dilates the pharynx. The ninth nerve supplies parasympathetic innervation to the parotid gland. The autonomic fibers of the ninth nerve arises primarily from the inferior salivatory nucleus with some from the dorsomotor nucleus of the tenth nerve. The postganglionic fibers join the auricotemporal branch of the mandibular division of the fifth nerve for distribution to the parotid gland. This is the nerve involved in the gustatory sweating. One of the most important functions of the ninth nerve is to carry visceral afferent fibers from the carotid body and sinus involved in the reflex control of heart rate, blood pressure and respiration. It conveys impulses from the carotid body, chemoreceptors and the carotid sinus baroreceptors and terminates centrally on the cells in the middle third of the nucleus of the solitary tract. So these are the important concepts of the clinical anatomy of the ninth nerve, glossopharyngeal nerve. The other important concepts of neurology I put in a question answer format in a book called Focus Neurology written by me Dr. S. Srinivas. This book is available online from all leading booksellers including Amazon. So if interested this book could be bought online. I hope you have enjoyed listening to these concepts of the clinical anatomy of the ninth nerve. If you have enjoyed it please like and share the link but please subscribe to my YouTube channel Dr. Srinivas Medical Concepts and my webpage Dr. Srinivas Concepts. Thank you. Bye.